Hello everyone. You are watching Funny E Heck Yes Info. Today topic is mechanical integrity and what are the requirements of an mechanical integrity program. Introduction. Mechanical integrity, MI, is just one of the 14 elements included in process safety management driven by the OSHA 1910.119 standard. Mechanical integrity, MI, can be defined as the management of critical process equipment to ensure it is designed and installed correctly and that it operates and is maintained properly, that is. No leaks and all elements are fit for service. A mechanical integrity program should take into account the inspection and testing of the equipment using procedures that are recognized and generally accepted good engineering practices and should also consider the suitability of newly fabricated equipment for usage. The process equipment covered includes 1. Pressure vessels and storage tanks. 2. Piping systems, including valves, other components. 3. Relief and vent systems and devices. 4. Emergency shutdown systems. 5. Controls, monitoring devices and sensors, alarms and interlocks, and 6. Pumps. The four key phases for an effective mechanical integrity program development are The key phases of MI program development are discussed above which include management responsibility, equipment selection and implementation through inspection, testing and application of proactive maintenance strategies. Properly trained and certified personnel conducting these activities are also a key part of an effective mechanical integrity program. 1. Management Responsibility which includes Facility Leadership Roles and Responsibilities Organizational Roles and Responsibilities Reporting and Auditing 2. Equipment Selection which includes Selection Criteria Level of Detail to be Addressed Documentation Requirement 3. Inspection, Testing and Proactive Maintenance which includes Planning Selection Scheduling Execution and Monitoring 4. Personal Qualifications which includes Skill or Knowledge Assessment Training Required Training Verification and Documentation Certification Requirement Refresher Training Contractor Training Requirement What are the requirements of a mechanical integrity program? Everyone has responsibility for safety is a phase that we often hear within a facility. It's just as true that everyone has responsibility for reliability, i.e. effective management of assets. However, an effective asset management program must be driven from the top down and effectively implemented from the bottom up. Following requirements to be fulfilled for an effective mechanical integrity program. Provide written procedures to maintain integrity of equipment. Train employees involved in maintaining integrity of equipment. Perform periodic inspection, testing and maintain records. Correct deficiencies in equipment. Assure that equipment is suitable and properly installed. Assure that maintenance materials, spare parts and equipment are suitable and correct for use in the process. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe and share our videos. If you want notes about this video, Please visit our website link given in description box. Have a safe day.